to techteasy.com. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to uh, make a cool um, logo or header, whatever you, either one, um, using GIMP. Um, it's going to be like a gradient kind of thing. Um, so just open up a new template. Um, you'll have to change the size depending on what you want. See, right here you can change the width and the height and then you click OK. Uh, but I'll just do the default one right now. Um, so you want to select your blend tool, which is right there, and then change your colors to a light color. I'm going to do blue for the first one. Uh, that's the foreground. And then I'm going to go back to that color and then go over here and almost go black. Um, it's pretty dark that's what you want and then just uh, click somewhere in the middle and drag to one of the corners oh, I forgot to um, make it radial uh, over here you want the shape to be radial not linear uh, it will automatically do linear but you don't want that okay so that's uh, what I like to make with GIMP um, and then you can just click on the text tool and add whatever text you want. Um, change the color. <clears throat> and then make it bigger. I also like to make the uh, title bold when I'm making a logo or header. Um, and then you just need to s try and center it as best you can. That looks about right, and I can always come back and fix it if it isn't. That looks pretty good. Um, it's a little. Oh. Okay, so. Once you're once you like how you've uh, got it, then you just want to click File and then Export. Um, I don't really need this, so I'm just gonna keep it here. Um, but that was how to the default. Um, but yeah, it's really good for headers like a WordPress header or blogger header, whatever, whatever kind of header you want, or you can make a logo with it. So that was that's it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.